Hey y'all, Reshamet here from IBM Engineering. Today, I'm going to show you a quick tutorial about streams with Doris Next. Now, what a stream is, is it's a way to create essentially a duplication of the project, but in this duplication of the project, you can create modifications to it, and when those modifications are deemed correct and appropriate, you are able to combine those modifications back to the main project. So pretty much how you can think of a stream is that it is a copy of the document where you make modifications inside of that copy of the document. You don't want to put that stuff back into the main project until you can be certain that it is correct and everything is good to go. So now to create the stream, all we need to do is go up to the top right hand corner and click on the name of the project. Now you see like this orange symbol with an arrow and you can click on the drop down menu for that and when you mouse over it, it says current configuration. And all you need to do is select the first option from the drop down menu on the right hand side that says create stream. Here you can put in a name for the stream and for this example, I'll just put in example stream. And you can also put in a description if you want to, and it's a good habit to get into. So once I have all this information filled out, we can leave the box checked off by default that will allow you to switch to the new stream. And finally, I'll just click on create. It'll take just a second. It can take some time depending upon how large the project is. And here is our custom stream. And we can verify that by taking a look in the top right hand corner where we see example stream as the stream name that we just created. Thank you all for watching. If you have any other questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to me on LinkedIn. You can find me at Brett Charmette.